Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to my stream. Yes, we have got some more Final Fantasy X-2 Fiend Tales in store for you today. But first, hello Koneko, welcome, welcome. Uh, I see you with the first. Breno, Breno, hello, how are you? Oh my gosh, wait. You're not a new chatter. When did I see you last? Hang on. Yes, you have chatted here before. Oh, I remember. You're my Australian friend. Hello, Breno. Hello, how have you been? Oh my gosh, it's been forever. I like your ears. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh no, I made the window too big. I made the window too big and now I can't can't get rid of it. Uh-oh, hang on. Ah, Twitch chat, you're so large. It's uh, there we go. There we go. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing so well. I'm doing so well, Breno. How are you? What has you up at this um this time of day? <laughs> I know my Australian friends uh don't get to come to my streams very often. Koneko, how was your holiday, by the way? Coding. Oh nice. Being boring. You're never boring. If you're here, you're not a boring person because I don't have any boring friends, okay? All my friends are interesting and cool. That's just how that is. That is just how that is. Holidays were good, kind of exhausting, but that's okay. I hope that means it was the good kind of exhausting. It sounds like it was the good kind of exhausting. My holidays were pretty relaxing. Um, but I've definitely had exhausting vacations before. Ever had a vacation that was like, Oh boy, I need a vacation from my vacation. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> I've had those. <laughs> I've had those. I had to go back to work on Tuesday. So everything's back in, back in the normal routine now. Um, at this point. Do, do, do. All right, let's get the game going. Since we're doing Fiend Tales, we can definitely continue the conversation while we play. Oh, oh, oh OBS, OBS wants to show the game immediately this time. Good job. Good job, OBS. I love that. Oh, wait, what's happening? My controller just disconnected. I was just pushing buttons. Okay, there we go. We're connected again. Okay, as you can see, we're in chapter two. I got back from home from my holiday vacation trip and the next day I slept until 2 p.m. Oh my God. <laughs> I've done that before. I've done that before, like an over 12 hour sleep. Um, those like, you know everything. those like you, you, it's like roulette, right? It's like you coin flip, whether you're gonna wake up from those feeling like the most amazing feeling you've ever felt or like the worst shitty feeling you've ever felt. <laughs> it's like 50, 50, um, on that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm glad you had a good vacation anyway. Um, did you, you were changing jobs in the beginning of the year or about to change jobs or something like that. Is everything going well with that? I hope so. I'm going to send you some good, uh, some good luck for new years. Uh, that that all goes well if it hasn't started yet, or that it's going well, you know, if it has. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I need to set up my team first. Need to organize the team. And Breno, um, how was your holiday? Was it good? Y'all got it. Y'all do a Christmas in July. Geekstra, good morning. Hello. Oh my gosh, all my friends are here today. Hi guys. I'm so happy to see you. Um, okay. Oh, I already set up my team last time, didn't I? I set it up yesterday. Yes, Iron Duke and Black Lore. I remember this. And we gave him Iron Duke and Black Lore too. Yes, we did. Okay. And we gotta go, because it didn't... I think we didn't get the Oversoul for the White Fang or the Guardian Beast. So I was gonna go try to kill the White Fangs again. See what's up with that. Yes, let's enter the battle. Yeah, my contract ended, so I'm slowly starting to search for a new job. Not really actively searching yet, though. I have some stuff to sort out that I really want to get done first. Oh, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Sometimes you need, like, an in-between. You know, it's it's not... The new job situation is not instant, typically. <laughs> uh, so I know exactly what you mean. Um, oh, did he oversold this time? I was not even paying no attention. I was not even paying no attention. Did one of them oversold? I guess we'll check. We'll go check after we fight them. Because I could have sworn I should have got the Oversoul before. I'm grinding Hogwarts Legacy, trying to beat these solo games I have while playing all my online games. Uh, I know what you mean, Geekstra. I am um, I'm so obsessed 
with uh, with WoW Season of Discovery right now. The only solo games I'm playing is uh, is here with you guys. <laughs> uh, so that's the true confessions. That's the true confessions right there. Um, <laughs> I uh, solo games what? Who? I don't know her. Um, I'm not acquainted. We're not friends right now. <laughs> I just you know too in too into it. You know, you get super into one game and it's like, yeah, okay. Yeah, no, okay. They did oversold last time and we just didn't get credit. I don't know. Whatever. Maybe we killed it too fast. Um, that's okay. We'll just fight this, the brothers over and over. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This will work. Like how many how many wolfos do you have to kill for Oversoul anyway? It can't be that many. My online games are Destiny 2, Call of Duty, Battlefield, Apex Legends, Overwatch 2. Oh my god, that's a lot of online games. <laughs> that's a lot of online games, my friend. I, I I'm always um surprised that Overwatch is still kind of a thing. I feel like I'm like amazed that it's lasted so long as like a popular game, you know? But I feel like Overwatch is still insanely popular. Like ridiculous. Uh, let's see. White Fang. Okay, yeah, they can kill the White Fangs no problem, so we do this. We just do this until they oversoul. And it takes uh, a 22. Okay, so sh that shouldn't take long because we're fighting two of them. Alright, um, I told you I've been wanting to play Kingdom Hearts, right? Yes! Uh, I picked up all the games for PlayStation, still got to get the console and buy the Kingdom Hearts 3 disc, but I have the games. Oh my god! One step towards it, one step towards it. And you know, for old consoles like that, if you, like, I don't know, well, I don't know if this will work in your country, but this is how I would do it here. I would, like, make myself a little Craigslist alert, okay, so that it emailed me when people posted, like, PlayStation, PlayStation 2, you know, those keywords. Because then you're going to get people that are just trying to, like, clear house. And um, and they're going to sell it to you for cheap. Or you might even be able to convince them to just give it to you. if Especially if it's not in that great of condition. Right? Because those people, they don't know the value of what they have a lot of times. Um, sometimes they do. But a lot of times they don't. So anyways, if I was you, that's what I would do. <laughs> um, and good luck on your search. Uh, but that's just an idea. I don't know if you have something similar in your country, like Craigslist, that you can do that with. And I assume you have, like, what we have where if you go to, like, kind of a larger-ish metropolitan area, you'll have, like, used game stores that would probably have the console. But, but they know what they have, and sometimes it can be very expensive to go to those kinds of places. I didn't even look at how what levels they were. I didn't even look at nothing to know how close we are to the fiend tails for these guys. Oh hell yeah, Bruno, get that pet lil. Pet lils are cute. They probably both need to be level 17 or something. That seems to be the level I'm always hitting for the fiend tails. Okay, we're 13 and 14. Okay, so we're we're quite a ways away, I'm pretty sure. Get them silver brothers. I don't know why I didn't get over Soul Credit the first time, but we'll find out. There's a few ways to get stuff secondhand, but I'm looking for a PS5, actually. Oh, okay, because is it backwards compatible? I got the games for PS4, and since the next console game will probably be on PS5, I figured we'd get PS5, so I won't have to get the new console to catch up when the series starts. Oh, you're right, Koneko. You're right, that's actually smart. <laughs> that's, that's smart, yeah, you're right. Hi there, I'm listening to Final Fantasy X music while leveling up on Hardcore. Tired of WoW music. Oh my gosh, hi Anubix. Hello, hello, hello. You're still playing Hardcore? I got... Anubix, I'm obsessed with Season of Discovery now. Hardcore? Friendship over. Friendship over with Hardcore. Season of Discovery is my new best friend. So, um, so I'm, I'm so glad though that there are still people playing Hardcore. Is it still like fun and good? The economy in Sod sucks. I assume y'all's economy is way fucking better like way better like everything's so expensive like can oh there's the oversoul like can i please borrow 500 gold please thank you to buy my bis because <laughs> i got some boe bises on my cat druid i cannot afford 
I cannot afford. They have Kingdom Hearts series on PS Premium. Um, is that, what, is that PlayStation's, like, is that PlayStation's thing? Like, store? Like, the, like, Xbox has, a Xbox Live Game Pass? Game Pass, that's the word I was looking for. I figured, but I prefer owning physical game. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We know, Koneko has a strong preference for physical media, which I can definitely understand. Um, it's easier to, way easier to preserve physical media. Um... If you've ever, you know, had the displeasure of your favorite thing leaving a, the streaming platform and then you can't find it for who knows how long, um, it's annoying AF. Annoying AF. Okay. Oh, wait. I need to talk I to know. him. Yeah. Show me. Show me. Did I get the oversoul this time? Why? You see this? Why? We killed the wife thing. Oversoul. I don't get it. Why are we not getting credit? I don't know. Something weird. I know. Um. This has been working. I don't understand what's going on. I don't understand what's going on. Because if I go back in and fight them again, it's not going to oversoul. My dual rogue team on alliance with a friend and with a friend both died. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Still texting my friend to come back. <laughs> like, baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. Yeah, so they're not oversoling again. I don't get it. Like, why? Why is this not counting? It's counted before when I've killed them with the with the things. But yeah, I ended up leveling up a cat druid in Sod. And that's what I'm maining right now because, like, Mangle Mangle, it's so fun, so easy. I deeps the hell out of everything. I destroy all. Uh, nothing can withstand my wrath. My cat wrath. Um, I just, I'm the best. It's amazing. Yeah, cat druid in Sod is, like, the best. Man, it's throwing a fit. Hold on, gonna BRB. Koneko's internet, behave. Hello. Excuse. Be nice. Koneko's was trying to chill and have a good Sunday. So you need to behave. I mean, these are white fangs, right? Like, these are two white fangs? Silver Brothers, white fang, white fang, yes. Sometimes my internet just refuses to work. I think it's fine. No, oh good. Well, I, I told it. I gave it a talking to, so hopefully that helped and it listened. <laughs> and a 22 lupine to oversoul. Yeah, I don't get it. I don't get it. I'm try it. We're basically just gonna try one more time and then I don't know. I guess skip over that one. Get it oversold some other time, some other way. Like maybe out in the world instead of in the in the thing. In the arena. Although it should count, I don't know. Maybe it doesn't count because this team was unlockable. Like how, maybe that's why both White Fang and the Xanarkin guard, the uh, Guardian Beast one didn't count. Because I unlocked these with Fiend Tails. As opposed to them just being typical. Okay, well anyways, let's go see if uh, it's time to read these tales. Because I think Peregrine's leveled up now. P -p Peregrine. Oh, here we go. Are you ready? You ready? Okay, okay. All right, let's see what's up with him. Look, now when we see this model up close, look at like how its eyes are so tiny compared to its like long ass beak. 
He's so funny looking. Okay, anyway. Stop staring into my soul. I don't need anyone poking around to try to figure me out. There's nothing I have to say to you. Why won't you just leave me alone? I want to sit here unnoticed until I get sent off. I always keep to myself in a tiny room in the temple, staring outside from my window. I have no friends, no family to look out for me. If I were to suddenly vanish one day, would anything be different? Since I was supposedly orphaned after an attack by sin, I was raised in the temple in Kilika. They tell me my parents were killed by sin, but I know that's a lie. Why would I be the only one to survive? Why would they leave me all alone? The monks told me that many other children were orphaned by sin. They told me I had to be strong to provide hope for the future of Spira, but I didn't want to go on living such a sad world. So I decided to take a gamble. One night I fled the temple. I knew how dangerous the woods were at night and that I should steer clear, but I went anyway. I knew that no matter what happened, I had to be able to face my problems alone. If I couldn't get through the forest, there was no reason to go on. That was how I felt back then. I laid my life on the line, but when I encountered a friend, I fo- I froze. Oh, when I encountered a fiend. But when I encountered a fiend, I froze. I don't want to die, I screamed. But it was the first time in my life that I truly wanted to live. Oh my gosh, oh no. Burbs have tiny, tiny, teeny, tiny eyes. Yeah, like this one has teeny, tiny eyes. Okay, let's see what happened. This poor child. Oh no, baby. brother dancing in the background that night i was attacked by fiends and i lost my life i wondered whether i would be going to the far plane all alone and i started to cry i was still only 10 years old i wasn't a grown-up yet but i wasn't a little baby either there were still so many things that i wanted to do but i lost my life all for a stupid bet I couldn't stop crying. Eventually, my tears turned into pyreflies. And before I knew it, both the tears and the pyreflies were gone. I had become a fiend. A fiend with giant wings. Under this sky, there are still many worlds I have yet to see. I am truly free. I can use my wings to fly anywhere I want to. I'll go on with this tale, as a fiend. I love the sky. It makes me want to go on living. See you again in the sky. A oh, friend's wow, my brain is dead. Yeah, my brain died too. The boy spread his wings and became a bird. I like that some of the fiend tales are like the fiends learning how to have a happy life as a fiend, and then some of the fiend tales are about them peacefully passing on. I think that's really nice that both can happen. Okay, let's see if he's done. He's done too, okay. In my previous life, I was killed. That's right, sentenced to death by the Bavel Temple. One year I spent in that cursed cell. As I climbed to the gallows, I fe fervently wished to become a fiend. There were 13 steps. I trembled with each step that I took. Truthfully, living as a fiend scared me more than death. It was like a contract with evil. There was one reason I wanted to remain in this world. I was innocent. I became a fiend to clear my name. My memories had faded after I became a fiend. Maybe it was the forced confessions or the transformation itself that made me forget. In any case, all I cared about now was proving my innocence. I used to claw, use my claws to carve the simple truth into my flesh. I was executed for a crime I didn't commit. The pain serves as a reminder for me to pursue the memories of this terrible injustice. Oh my gosh, this is a sad one. I remember where the incident occurred, but what happened there? Fragments of my memory are slowly returning. At the scene, I witnessed a murder. A man was killed. Moon lilies have been placed there now. Were they there? Were they put there to honor the memory of the deceased? These lavender flowers are the only clue I have. Whoever left those flowers holds the key to this crime. I decided to stake out the area. The moon lilies had already withered. Day after day, I waited. Sometimes I lost myself to my new fiend nature and forgot my purpose. I would tear at my flesh to remember, day after day of obsessing. This place had been forgotten after I was executed. No one approached. I found no clues. Then came the day when you captured me. One year from that day of my execution, two years since the crime took place. Perhaps the person who left the flowers will return to that place again. I'm running out of time. Please, you must allow me to go back there. Oh God, okay. You didn't do it. You didn't do it, Kukul Khan. I believe you. Let's go find the real, real murderer. Stake out day one. 
Oh, we're going to do a stakeout. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for giving me what I wanted. Stakeout, day five. This is the daily grind of a stakeout. A place where nothing changes, hours of no movement. And a criminal that never shows up. Why is he convinced the criminal would come back to where they did the murder? Like, lots of people just randomly walk through Makalania. I'm not really sure I understand. Stakeout, day 10. Obviously, this fiend knows something we don't. I just keep waiting. Waiting for the one who brings moon lilies. Stakeout, day 13. Gosh, you are dedicated. Hmm? This woman is the killer. This woman. Was once my lover? When I took the fall for a crime I didn't commit, it was what I wanted. I turned myself in for her, and I was imprisoned as a criminal. The one possibility. These flowers are not for me, for the man who was killed, or not for the man who was killed, but for me. Why did she kill him? Why did I take the fall? These are the things I would rather not remember. Oh, oh. The real reason is probably quite simple. I just wanted to be alone. Alone in a world with no lovers and no dead men. Oh, that one was sad. Oh my gosh. I understand. I understand what you did. I understand, even though we don't have a lot of context. All right, who do we have left that we need to do? Okay, we've got this guy. Okay, exactly three left, all right. All right, so let's give them some, let's see, who do we have? Battlesnake, Armet, Skink. Mm. All right, I think that um, doing Black Lore and where's the other one? Where's my Iron Dukes? There they are. Got reorganized somehow. So black, the Black Lore and Iron Duke combo really, really worked. So we're gonna do... Uh, not on him, not on him. Let's put the Black Lore and Iron Duke on Battlesnake. Oh, not Chocobo. Uh, we can do Crystal Bangle and... I don't know. I guess we can give him a ribbon. Protect him against some status ailments. Okay, that should be good. Okay, let's go back. I want to try one more time because I just don't, I don't understand why this is happening. Why did this oversoul, oversouling them here in the battle 
thing work fine with getting the other ones, but it's not working for White Fang, and it didn't work for the Guardian Beast either. Like, do I have to do it outside of the arena for some reason? On these ones specifically? I don't know. Why do y'all keep curing and not attacking? Thank you. Okay, y'all are healing way too much. You need to calm down. Oh, it's ad break time. If you're seeing an ad, thank you for continuing to hang out. If you're not seeing an ad, thank you so much for being a, a sub. Thank you so much. Okay. While they're in an ad, I'm just gonna go check one more time with uh with him. Do you ever feel like doing things, but you're tired and also you have to eat and... <laughs> have a good dinner, Koneko. Have a good dinner. I hope you have a delicious, delicious dinner. Okay. What? This is the Fiendtail Bestiary. Yeah. That's the Fiendtail Bestiary. I know. Shinra's Bestiary is where we can do... Yeah, I just don't... Yeah, very interesting, very interesting. I know. Welcome back from the ad. Welcome back everyone from the ad. Thank you so much for tolerating that. It helps us where so that people don't get hit with ads immediately when they come onto the stream, which um, I really appreciate you guys for tolerating that. All right, let's do... There we go. Okay. We're gonna try it one more time, and then we're gonna just, like, give up, I guess, on trying to oversold them this way. And we're gonna go back to doing the tournament. And this totally worked for the ones that we unlocked with the regular standard cup. It worked for the ones that didn't need to be unlocked at all. So, very interesting. Why it's not working for the ones that you unlock with standard cup hard, I do not know. So if anybody knows more about 10-2 than me, uh, you know, please enlighten me. I would love to know why this is happening. They should oversoul again soon. Speedy little bitches. At least they are missing a lot with these guys. And they keep trying to go for the skink, which is most likely to miss with. They got Armit, rude. Gonna avenge you. Yeah. Battle Snake probably just needs one more level. Come on, do your flares, boys. There we go. All 
All right, let's go see about the tails. Okay, Battlesnake, are you ready? No, not quite yet. Okay, I guess they need one more level. Armet, you need a couple more levels. Yeah, and Skink, you need one more level. Okay. Oh, excuse me. When you burp and hiccup at the same time, that's the best. <clears throat> okay. Let's do the arena. And we'll try again. soul this time. Oh, they keep getting Armet. Why? That's so rude. Oh, there's the oversoul again. Okay, so he oversold again, and we're gonna kill him. Okay, let's go check Shinra's bestiary. I know. Yeah, it just doesn't work. It just doesn't work for the White Fang. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna have to mark that. So we'll, I'll italicize it. There we go. Yeah, it just doesn't work for that one. I guess it's not going to work for the Guardian Beast either. Because it did the same thing to me. I feel like it should work. So I don't really understand what the difference is there. I know everything. Alright, let's go see what we got for some tales. Okay, let's read the skink one. Will you listen to my tragic tale of cruel fate? I was born to a noble family, but here I am now in this hideous form. What a terrible curse to bear. Only one thing can lift this curse, the pure kiss of a lovely maiden. Why do you look at me so? Do you think I could make up such a story? Yes, yes, completely do think that. And so, my dear Yuna, it shames me to no end to ask you this, but would you do me the honor of... Yes, your luscious lips will surely cure me. You refuse? Not on my life? I see that the High Summoner is quite a hard nut to crack. Riku! Oh my god, he just moved on to the other girls. Wow. Riku, my lovely. A favor, if you will. I need your help to return to my former self. You are the only one who can save me from this horrid nightmare. Go jump in a lake, you say? <laughs> well, if not the lips, maybe a peck on the cheek? Just a little kiss is all I ask, pretty please. Come on, just as a formality. Tch, I thought that momentum would carry. <laughs> oh my god, is he going to go for pain next? This is quite a hard ask, but I need your help with something. Oh, but there's no pressure. I won't hold it against you if you refuse. It's just a small favor, really. Uh, Lady Payne, are you listening? Mm, you'll beat it, beat the curse out of me? Uh, no, I've never been good with violence. Ugh, not like you're my type anyway. Oh my god. This lecherous lizard. He who was destined, denied a kiss from YRP had left the airship and lowered the standards for his pure maiden. Hey there, beautiful. Want to embark on a journey of love with me? No! That's a child. You <laughs> no way gross. Good job, girl. Good job. 
Damn it. <laughs> I guess I can't be too picky anymore. Hey there, beautiful. Agreed. Oh, she gonna do it. Even I have my pride? I thought you said that would cure you. Are you a liar? Oh, a sexy hottie. Want to make some unforgettable memories together? Yes. <laughs> Fiend hunt completed. I'm getting a little tired of looking. Maybe a kiss is just asking too much. I mean, with the way I look... Oh, Shinra! Kiss from Shinra. He was able to become a human again. Nobody knows about that. What? Oh my god, it worked? It did not. I know about that. Did it work then? Oh my god, Shinra. Shinra, you hero. Okay, let's check on the Armet. He kept dying, so I doubt it. Yeah. What about the battle snake? Uh, he is, yeah. But we're gonna get Armet first. Okay, so we'll put Chocobo in the in the group. Uh, let's see, organized team. Let's add Chocobo. We'll give him Iron Duke and where's his flare thing? There it is, Black Lore. Okay. Oh, he's only level eight. Poor Chocobo. Okay. Uh, battle simulator. Oh no, we realized that wasn't working. So we need to do a tournament. Chocobo's gonna die so fast in this tournament, I feel like. Come on, guys. Just flare. Just flare over and over. This guy's got super high defense. Hopefully Chocobo's flaring. Yep. Good. Keep doing that. Let's speed him up. This is gonna take forever with this ridiculous defense. Come on, just keep flaring. He will die eventually. That's the best way to get damage on him. Oh, they're low on MP. My two flare ones. Oh no. I don't know about this. Maybe I should have had one with the the Ragnarok. Or whatever that combo is. Ragnarok and Ring. So they don't have any, um, they don't use their MP for flares. Yeah, I feel like this is not gonna happen. The damage is just too low. He's gonna take him out eventually.
Yeah, now it's like zero and one. Oh! Oh! Oh, I was not expecting. I was not expecting. That was, uh... That was interesting. Okay. Okay, well, let's keep going. Red Star and Dark Star? I don't think we fought them. Who's that? Oh. Okay. Tindaloo and Deflon. There's Flare doing what it's supposed to do. Oh! Oh, yeah, you can't do that on the Armette. Okay, nice. And this is good, getting my Chocobo leveled up, because I will need to use him later. Okay, what's next? Hellbreeders? Okay, we fought them. So the Tindaloos. Yep. You're gonna love what happened with dinner today? Please, how was your dinner? Tell me. We had beef ribs yesterday for dinner. Oh my god, they were so good. I love beef ribs. Delicious. Like meat butter. Okay. Um, we should be done with these two fiend tails now so we can go read those. Right. I'm actually quite happy that I became a fiend. Do you find that odd? When I was human, life was so difficult. Things are so much better for me now. I mean, right now I have freedom. It feels good just to be alive. Until recently, I had no memory of my human life. I'm sure it's because I didn't want to remember. There's a cave where fiends such as I work together to build new lives for ourselves. But one day I suddenly remembered those terrible days of battle. The days when I was married. Oh my fucking god, really? Um, I was once a sailor. I was wooed by my husband and moved to move from Besaid to Kilika. Oh, it's a woman. Okay. My husband was a good man, but he never could stand up to his mother. My mother-in-law considered me a rube, and she, she and my sister-in-law chided me in my husband's absence. Of course, I didn't just sit there and take it, though. But those days of arguing would come to an end when Sin attacked Kilika. Even then, my mother-in-law and I were arguing, and we did so to the bitter end. But looking back, I'm glad I have those memories. It makes me grateful for what I have right now. Well then, I suppose I should be getting back to the others. Mom wanted to make this dish that needs a prepackaged sauce, so she got all the ingredients except for the sauce. So she ended up improvising with curry sauce. Oh my God, so you had curry. What 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 um what was it? Like curry chicken, curry beef, what, what was it? Because I think curry sauce goes on everything. Um, I love me a Masamon curry sauce on literally anything. It's delicious. I'm home. How did it get so late? Oh, you're back early. <laughs> what is happening right now? <gasps> you see, I regained my memories too, Armet. How did you know my human name? No, it can't be. Oh, fate can be a funny thing. It looks like ours is conjoined. <gasps> It's me, Armet. It's the mother-in-law. My mother-in-law? Oh my god. 
Come on now. Don't just stand there like an idiot. My sister-in-law too. Oh no. <gasps> Hurry up and make dinner. <laughs> She's got evil in-laws. No. Where's the husband? Because he was a sailor. I guess he didn't die in the Kilika attack. So he's not there. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Armet, is my dinner ready yet? Uh, yes, coming right up. You don't have to do that anymore, Armet. You're a fiend now. You can have a different life. It's the same exact menu as before. How could it take you so much time to make this little food? Is is this it? Hurry up and eat. There's still laundry and cleaning to do. Get on it, Armet. Just leave, girl, just leave. Oh my god, you don't have to take this. Just get out. Get out while you still can. What is this? Too spicy. Water! Good. I'm glad you did that. No, wait a minute, Armet. Good standing up for yourself, Armet. I hope she's laughing. Get back at him. Start of round two. <laughs> Good job standing up for yourself. All right, let's see the battle snake. Hey, listen, I keep this secret from everyone, but I actually hate fighting. It's a South African dish. We make a variant that isn't as spiced as the normal version. The only thing I know about South, South African food is peri-peri, which I love peri-peri sauce. Peri-peri chicken is delicious. Um, yeah, we, we can get the Nando's peri-peri sauce in bottles here, and uh, I like it. Hey, listen, I keep this secret from everyone, but I actually hate fighting. Isn't it about ego in the end? We might be friends, but we're still living creatures. Having to fight and kill each other is just so depressing. But still, my job is to defeat my opponents. If I don't kill fiends, my human bosses get all hissy. So I have to shoot, you know? Although the whole time I'm thinking duck or run or don't get hit. Just between you and me, all right? My bullets are all blanks. Even if they hit you, they won't kill you. But that's about the best I can do. Don't expect much from me more. Did you know some fiends are on the brink of extinction? Like quirrels, for example. But that's because people keep killing them for their fur. You know they fetch a high price, right? So anyway, I just can't sit here and do nothing. I think that everyone has a purpose in life. I used to think that I did all I could, but really, I was always just depending on others. I've decided to dedicate myself to protecting fiends. That's one thing that only I can do. What do you think? Will you root for me? Okay, yeah, protect the fiends. I'm referring to boba tie. It's very good. You should try to find a recipe. Yeah, I've never had that. Deep in the valleys of the calm lands are a secret hunting ground of notorious poachers. Are we going to fight the poachers? <laughs> Got a nice one. This one ain't too bad either. Get those poachers, Battle Snake. Sorry about this. There he is, the savior. Well, what it, what's this about? Fiends protecting other fiends? That's right, dude. You better get used to it. Run away. A battle snake that protects fiends from poachers. 
The rumor spread quickly throughout Spira. At his own risk, he continues to send humans his message. That fiends protect their comrades, just as humans do. Oh, I love it! Indeed, he is the fiend world's first park ranger. Oh my god. Okay, Peacekeeper has entered the fiend arena. Nice. Okay, so that's all the fiend tales for chapter two. Uh, we gotta now go actually finish the chapter. Let's put um, the girls back in the party. And we gotta give them their accessories. Oh, we need to remove them from the chocobo. Okay, and I think I need to go organize. Yeah, so they're in the right order. Okay. Um, we'll do Iron Duke, Crystal Bangle. What else is worth it? What else is worth it at this low level? Mm -mm -mm. I guess we can just give her a ribbon. That should be fine. Okay, so I just Googled this um, boba tie and I, I figured out how to pronounce it, so I'm saying it more correctly now. Or no, boba tea. Boba tea, that's how you say it. Yeah, so we gotta go to Guado Salam now. And it's like, it looks like beef and sauce, and you do it in a skillet, and it looks basically like a, like a hamburger helper type of thing, but like, yeah, anyway, it looks amazing. I hope this works. Oh, we can't skip? Worry after okay. Okay. Oh, because we have that prompt. Boba tea is apparently a um, a national dish of South Africa. It sounds like I'm saying boba tea, like boba, but no. Boba tea. Reporting for. D yeah, that thing looks good, Kaneko. I should try that. Can I skip yet? Yes, I can skip now. Thank God. Okay. Can I not? Okay, it's can't, can't skip this one. The boss is a different... Suppressing her natural charm and... <sighs> you, go to the... What? You know. Orange's duties. You have to do Orange's duties, Yuna. Okay, let's go do them. Water so I'm like Gagazat was not letting me skip. I'm waiting. Okay, time to sassify. Uh, this corner. Oh. Oh, not there. Oh my gosh, is it in the middle? Yes. I should have been able to figure that out from the first two. Oh no. That's not it. 
Here we go. That's nice. You're good. Thanks, LeBlanc. I try. That's not it. That is good. I can skip this one. Okay. Can I skip this one? No. Out like a light. The boss fell asleep. We've been waiting for her to. We'll just have to keep waiting. In the meantime, you. Uh, switch. The back of the living. Yeah, we really can't skip it. Okay. All right, time to go downstairs. Switch is here. Skip. All right, let's go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, time to fight. Welcome back from the ad. Thank you guys so much for tolerating those. It's very helpful so that when people first log into the stream, they do not get an ad immediately. So I really appreciate you guys tolerating those. I would have no ads if that was an option, but Twitch does not give me that option. If you want to see completely ad free, you can go watch on YouTube, but of course I do not uh, pay attention to the chat very much there. That's it? So that's the trade off. It's just really hard to watch the chat, um, the YouTube chat in OBS. All right, in addition to just completing the mission down here, there is one thing we need to make sure we pick up in, uh, in the bedroom. So we're gonna go into that bedroom first. Elementillery. Actually, we probably should save. So we've been playing for an hour. I would hate to lose that progress. Get him, get him, get him. That wasn't much fun. Okay, we got the gold hairpin, and I think maybe it must be in the other bedroom. It's for doing well on that uh, mission, the massage mission. We need that. Got to make sure you get that. Which I don't even know if it's skippable. Hey, this is Let's watch it. We need to get Crimson Sphere 10. Yeah. It's only naughty girl. What about you? The bosses or leave it to me. Get him. Don't you just fall 
surprises. Russian Roulette, they should give that ability to the Gunner Dress Sphere. Yeah. All right. All right, we're in the booby trap stage. So we remember how to do this. Oop, really easy. They cooking. Y'all can hear the boys cooking in there. Making some football snacks. Hi, lady. <laughs> What's up? You're about to see a lady tail. Lady. I wish you wouldn't stand right in front of the screen. That would be nice. <laughs> uh, did I do it? Okay, yes, I did it. Alright. Hello. What's up? Those are drinks. Okay, oh, we're going that way again. I can't see the game. Hello. Oh, maybe don't rub the microphone. That's not the best idea. Jump. 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 And we can't jump down here. We have to let the spikes push us down. Okay, what are we doing? Come here, lady. Come here. There we go. That's a better spot to stand. Come here. There we go. There we go. Is that better? Is that better, lady? You get some pets? You are shedding so much. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I had to push the joystick. I had to push the joystick for a second. I know, baby. I know. You need pets. I get it. Now we have cat fur. On the cat call. <laughs> hey, baby. You're shedding so much. Hey. I think she's owed attention when I'm at the computer for some reason. Why do you do that? You lucky, you cute. You lucky, you cute. Sorry, we had to win. I'm not. Now there's cat fur everywhere. Your hair is everywhere. Get in there. Hey, lady. Hello, Yuna. Get in there. There we go. It's gotta be in here, right? Let's split up and look. Can we skip this scene? Yes, we can. Okay. I went. But not this one. A lot of trouble gathering those pieces. All for no gee woo 
So don't you lay a finger on it. Let's get him, boys. Yes, boss. Would you like some LaCroix? Mm hmm? Would you like some LaCroix? <laughs> I don't think you should have LaCroix. Although it's probably fine, it's mostly water. And I don't think cats even really take, uh, have much of a sense of, um, taste. Mostly their sense of taste has to do with smell. So I don't think LaCroix would even taste like anything to them. Because it barely has flavor for humans. gonna hear w wait a second uh, please mission complete you climb in my lap okay you can climb in my lap That is the Colossus, Vegna Gun. Oh, we can't skip this, okay. We finished our analysis of the sphere. I see Pavel hasn't lost. Exactly. Those Yevon scum have been cons- I can't Anyone skip. Uses there, okay, yeah, I can't. I, lady was blocking. But it's not Hi, lady. All we have to do is shaky shake- That's what Nucci's got in mind. What about hey, you? baby. Me? The summoner who defeated- so then I waiting where don't be silly love on your I'm... airship of course Ever heard of... what come on then lay him lay down in the lap and don't pace back and forth so Sin much is gone the calm is here this cat don't know how to not pace the eternal calm <laughs> hey I I've realized how fragile it can be. Save your progress. Yes, we can save. Okay, lay down. Can I do your eyes? There we go. Girl. Oh, it lets me skip this. Okay, good. All right, now we are at the point of no return. We have to go to Bavel. So how Luckily, because this is the third time we've done this, there's a lot of stuff we can kind of skip over here, and we can try to just do, like, what's required. It's obvious. We nab the head honcho. Then we make him lead us to Vegna. Lady, you are making so Not much that. noise. I got no problem with this. Our target is the new Yevon Praetor. A girly man like that doesn't stand a chance without his escort. I can't even skip text right here. Careful. He's much stronger than he looks. Company. <laughs> Who goes there? <laughs> it's those Youth League spies. We won't have you defile this place like you... We're not defiling uh, anything, y'all. Good luck. Wow, abandon. Uh, the Blanc the Abandoner. Okay, I think she's done with me. I think she's gotten enough enough pets. Mission time. All right, is, um, what's the last ability that they have for the gun mage that they actually learn that way? Oh, no, there's still a bunch more. Okay. Can I take this? I think I can't take it because I chose, yeah. We just have to fight our way. Good 
Good thing I have a lint roller right here from yesterday when I needed one. This is war, we fight. Yeah, you didn't even get to flamethrower. Where's the edge of this? So I can heal him. Oh my gosh. Might have to just wait for an unskippable cutscene or something. And if you talk to this kid, remember two more will come fight you. So we can just skip that. Where is the edge of this thing? I don't see it. Oh my gosh, is it? Wait a second. Is it like a biscuit can where it's like wrapped around? I do not know, whatever. Put this down, put this down. <laughs> Get to a stopping point, and then you can clean the fur off of you. And none of these guys want to fight me either, for whatever reason. Oh no, not down there. We have to make it go down. I think is on this side. Okay, yes, and then we go to the other side, flip the switch, and then we can go to the Bevel Underground. Maybe I can try to find the edge of this thing. Yeah. It is like a biscuit can. Oh, look at that. That angle. Oh, this is a weird one. Wait, what are fiends doing in the temple? The temples reek of secrets. Don't let a couple oh, of can I skip this? Throw you. Nope. Of course there's fiends in the temples. What do you expect, Riku? You know Bevel's full of craziness.
right, next part. We've got our Dutch angle room. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you, Barkeep. I'm sorry. Just kidding. We're just going to save. Oh, can't skip. Okay. Okay, this twisty design for this thing is, like, way better. I'm not gonna lie, than the regular, like, square peel-offs, so... That kind of nice. Let's go! Cat fur <laughs> everywhere! <laughs> Skip here? No, still can't skip. Oh wait, I think I have to go up to the edge. Yeah. Oh, we can skip this one. Okay. Wee! Slide down. Okay, I think I got most of the cat hair off of me. <laughs> Enough of it where I don't feel like completely fur coated anyway. So, I think we will live. I think we'll live, you guys. Okay, here we go. Let's throw these away. Get in there. Okay much more comfortable. Alright, let's beat up some shit in Bavel. Remember, we have to defeat all the towers. We don't need to do the optional boss, though. We just have to defeat the um, odd number towers and fight the boss, then we're done. We don't need to get another ribbon at this point. Okay, this is one. Yeah, okay, so we do one. And then we go counterclockwise skipping. Okay, I did the fiend tail for one of you. You could live better. All right, and last tower here, this one is the Baus. Oh, yeah. 
He should go down pretty easy, just like usual. The end. Now, since we're not worrying about the ribbon, we can just walk right on down. I don't think there's even any random encounters up here. Okay, now in this part of the Bevel area, there is a blue bullet we're going to try to get. Um, if we fight the uh, Kukulkans, the basilisk looking things, we can get that Heaven's Cataract ability on our blue mages. So, we're going to try to do that. Yeah, I would love some snacks. Okay, explain away. We have chicken cordon blue bites. Okay. It's not mushroom. Okay. We have feta, caramelized, mm -hmm. and raspberry and green. Ooh, okay. And what's the different sauces for which ones? Oh, um, for the cordon blue Okay. That's honey rasta and that's the chipotle honey mustard. Oh, okay, okay. I'll show you guys what he said. Okay, this is chicken cordon blue bites right here. This is the stuffed mushroom. This is the other thing that I forgot. Hey. This is caramelized onion, and this is the brie and jelly thing. You need Raspberry jelly. Okay, so we're gonna have some snacks. Oh, it lets me skip, good. Okay, so we, um, if you want to do this puzzle again to get another Ragnarok and another ring accessory, you can, but we're going to skip it. I just don't, I don't see why I need more of those. I am good at this stage. Like, we rock it, so unnecessary. Okay, let's try these chicken cordon blue bites because they smell amazing. Got some mustard and some honey racha with those. That's pretty good. Okay, I think I just go this way. Yep. Then I hop up. Up. And then that lets me go that way. But then I don't think I can encounter because that takes me to the boss. So I think we need to encounter um, a Kulikon first. So we're just going to run around and try to get one of those. It should be in this area. Oh, 
Oh, there's one. Okay. So we'll kill the Vertigo. And then we'll just wait. I'm probably gonna have to do the stone thing. Yeah, I'm gonna have to unstone her. Where's my sauce? Welcome back from the ad break. Thank you so much for tolerating that. Do I not have any sauce? Oh my gosh, I don't have any sauce. Do I have any remedies? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, I guess I can use that. There we go. Come on, Heaven's Cataract. Give me that blue bullet. There, they all learned it. Okay, fabulous. That was easy. Oh, I didn't mean to remedy again. Dang it, pain, sorry. There we go. The mushroom thing's really good. I think these almost have been like frozen snacks from BJ's or something. Wait, where am I? Oh, oh, this is part of the puzzle. Ha! I messed it up. Hang on, I gotta go up here maybe? I don't wanna do the puzzle. Yeah, there we go. Okay, there is one other blue bullet you can get in this chapter, and that is Drill Shot from Barrel Eye, the boss. So I'm going to show y'all how to do that. It's not difficult, but there is kind of a trick to it. All right, to get Barrel Eye to use Drill Shot, you have to use 10, um, 10 things that change his HP, okay? So like we're gonna attack twice and then we can potion him. And we can probably potion him again because we did a lot of damage. So that's three, four, five. Let's do another potion. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Suffer. Oh, ten. And then you should use drill shot on Yuna. And let's remedy that. Stop on pain. It's not and... over. There we go. Now she learned drill shot. And it did kill her, but that's okay. We're gonna Phoenix down her. We have white wind, so we can do ha we can handle it. Okay, now we gotta do it again. All right, so one, two, three, four, five. Well, I think I want to heal everybody. Six. I just attacked him. Seven. Suffer. Eight. Ah. Nine. 
See, I've kind of lost track. <laughs> I've lost track. Oh no. I know we don't want it to be Yuna, so I'm gonna have Riku and Pain do it's some more over. potions on him. Oh, there we go. Okay, he drill shotted Pain. Okay, fabulous. All right, let's get her back up. All right, and then we need to. Oh, she has no... Okay, she's the only one with... Okay. She's the only one with any MP. Alright, let's use some X potions as well. Suffer. Okay, one... Two... close, so I'm a little unsure. Uh, nine. Let's just do Riku. She's the only one that doesn't have it yet. Oh, she did it on herself. Dang it. Suffer. Oh, it didn't work. Okay. Oh, she has ribbon. That's right. Um... We go okay everyone's got drill shot now we can just kill him so that's how you do it if i hadn't lost count it would have been even easier but i did so whatever so once you do the 10 attacks he will use drill shot on whoever that 10th attack was and it's not just like it's just anything that moves his hp so you can give him potions just like i did so that strategy works really well all right now we just destroy Goodbye, Barrelai. Okay, and that's the two um, blue bullet abilities you can get in Chapter 2. The Heaven's Cataract and the Drill Shot. Sorry. I'm going ahead. Okay, we're gonna try the onion thing now. You have your reason. Phil Much later. Wait up! Okay, the onion thing's really good. With so many things woven together. What could be waiting where the threads meet? Oh, good question, Yuna. Oh no! Bahamut time! Even without the cutscene, the music just, ugh, ugh. It hurts. It hurts. I have to eat my other chicken cordon bleu to heal my sorrows. Thank <laughs> you. 
My girls are such low level. The Iron Dukes are doing all the work. Let's see how low damage they're doing. Bahamut. Sorry, tiny child. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So sad. Why is this happening? I wish you were here. <gasps> Ashlyn, hello! You've come in at such a sad part. Thank you, Pain. You were right. We had to fight it, didn't we? Yeah, Yuna, and you're gonna have to fight the others, too. Don't worry, you'll see. Nothing. Can I skip now? No, I still can't skip. This hole was made... You think it was Vagnagon? Ash, how was your holiday? Oh my gosh. Unreal. <laughs> Mine was good. I had a really good holiday. We went on a cruise. It was so nice. What? Um, I have to say though, for uh, New Year's, I didn't Not do here. nothing. I went to it sleep. Must have <laughs> in town, I was so yeah, um, it was good. It was really nice and relaxing. I don't think so. And the cruise was so good. We're gonna go back in March so that um, Jeff can see the boat. We went on the Mardi Gras, the Carnival Mardi Gras. Yes, so he's gonna be able to go. So I'm gonna do it all again very soon. Like Twinsies, right? Really <laughs> right. What'd you do? What'd you do for the holidays? It was good? Oh, good. I can feel it crumbling, falling away from beneath our feet. New Year's, I played well. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> Mood, I'm still obsessed. I'm still playing the hell out of Sod. I'm still playing the hell out of Sod. <clears throat> Loving it. Actually, though, my deeps on my um, Warlock, I was not so happy with. So... I'm playing a cat druid now. M mangle, mangle, mangle. You know, it's uh, it's pretty good. I feel pretty OP. Not gonna lie, I freaking love it. So that's my main now. Yeah, you're cat druiding now too. Cat druid is the best. Okay, can we skip this? It won't even let me pause. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, we can skip this. Yeah, fiends pouring out of the temple. Been raiding on my druid and my shaman. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, we're gonna have our raspberry jelly thing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's the best one. Mm-hmm. Not cat druiding? Oh, you're still healing druid. I have the name already? Ash Cat? Oh my god, that's so cute. So, I think you don't know this because we're newer friends, but um, my roommate's cat, Jeff's cat, is named Ash. Um, we don't, you don't see Ash very much in the uh, videos or streams or anything, but uh, Ash is the gray one, and sometimes uh, she gets called Ash Cat, which is so funny. Resto Druid, Best Druid, if you say so, I guess, whatever. <laughs> Can't relate. <laughs> but I really, really like the, uh, the Feral, the Cat Druid DPS in uh, Sod. It's usually not that viable in Classic, but in Season of Discovery, it's awesome. Okay, so now that we're in Chapter 3, it's time to fill up on feeds. Can I add you on Discord? Of course. Defo. Oh, you should get in my Discord, too. That's probably the easiest way. If you join this Discord, then you'll be able to get into my DMs. And uh, you'll be able to keep up with where I am and stuff like that. like I'll close my DMs for a lot of discords and things so but if you're in that one um you'll always be able to sit, put post messages in there and I'll definitely see them all right creature creator
Okay, so yes, we just have the chocobo. Okay, so time to fill up on fiends. Now, chapter two did not have a lot of new fiends, but chapter three has a lot of new fiends. So let's go trap them. Let's go trap them. Okay. Cool beans, I completely forgot to add you before. And I felt bad. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> it's all good. I think, okay. I don't know if I'm speaking out of pocket because I'm not an officer or anything. But the way things were explained to me, like, I think you're welcome back, actually, if you changed your mind. So I don't know if that's, like, getting into too much because obviously I wasn't there. I was on a cruise when things happened. But anyways, I'm pretty sure you're welcome back if you want to come back the way it was explained to me. Just saying. I don't know if you want to do that, but... I'm just saying, I'm just saying. And I might be totally speaking out of turn. Anyways, okay, we're gonna, yeah, we wanna catch some special ones first. So in Besaid, we definitely want to use a special trap pod for human. And look who we get. We can get buddy. Yes, you can get, you can get brother and buddy. So yeah, there we go. Okay, and I think that's the only human for Chapter 3. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only human you can get in Chapter 3. Alright, and then we're gonna go to Thunder Plains. I think, no. I, <coughs> I try to breathe my spit. <laughs> Anyways, okay. Um, let's actually catch some of the large ones. We have two large trap pods I can see, so there's a large one in Visade we can get. Okay, Malbro. Yes, that is the one we wanted. Okay. Um, the, there's a couple of other large ones. Let's go... In Xanarkin, the only thing we can get is this one large one, so let's get that one. I can chat about Discord if you want. Okay. Drama behind the scenes. Deal with a few others. Oh, okay, okay. Got it. Understood. I hear what you're saying. Okay. Ironside, that's what we, uh... Oh wait, that's not the one. Huh. Ironside on my list says it's from Kilika, but I guess you can get it in Kilika or Xanarkin, so that's really interesting. Yeah, we can allow into the gold wings. If you want more Ds, just hit me up in Discord. Well, I always want the hot goss. <laughs> I can't help myself. I can't help myself. I need to know the goss. Okay, we can get four more. So I might, we'll see. We'll see after stream. So that was interesting. Okay. So that's not the one I thought I was going to get from Xanarkand. Oh, well. <clears throat> okay, we got some mediums, too. Just DM me whenever you're free. Okay. <laughs> Coffee time. All right. So let's go to... Trying to decide where I want to put the medium. I think I want to try to get, okay. So there is one that's like a chain that you do in this chapter. So let's try to get that. Uh, it starts with a diva from Kilika. Okay, Queen Kawiril. I do need that one so we can get her. Uh, set trap pod. Okay, let's try again. Let's get the diva. There we go. Yes. Okay, I think I have room for two more. I have room for two more. I guess I should just use these two smalls. Okay, let's try to get the small one from Bisade. 
There we go. Yes. Barbatua. That's what I wanted. Mm -mm -mm. Let's try to get the small one from Kilika. Assassin B. Yes, that's what I wanted. <clears throat> All right, as you guys remember, leave this one to me. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. Uh, Leave this one to me. For the humans, we just released them, so we're gonna release Buddy. Also, Barbatua is one of the ones where you just, um, it says creature analysis failed, this fiend lives to fight, so we can just release him immediately. Okay, and then we can trap two more. Mm, I guess we can use this special one. Let's use this special one on the element we need to get from Thunder Plains. It's the only thing. Okay, blue elemental, yes. Oh, Trap Pod M. Don't normally get an M. Okay. Um, well, there's lots of mediums we could get. I guess we'll try to get one of the Besaid mediums. Okay, Flan Rojo. All right, we are full now. We are full now on fiends. All right, so for chapter three, there is like some things that we do need to do so that we can kind of see the scenes that we wanna see. We can like do all the things that we need to do. So the first one is grabbing the a crimson sphere from this chapter. I think this is missable. So let's set up our party. We definitely need to go ahead and do the deva because that's like a chain situation. So put the Deva and the Blue Elemental in our party. Okay. Um... Let's give you the Ragnarok. And then... Oh wait, it's not Ragnarok, is it? It's... No, it's Ragnarok and Ring. Yeah, I did that right, okay. It had been a second since I used it, so I completely forgot. Okay, and then let's give you... Oh, the Iron Dukes are on the girls. Okay. Um... Okay, there we go. Iron Duke and... It's not Black Tome. I always wanted it to be Black Tome, but it's not. It's Black Lore. There we go. That gives them the flair. Okay. Let's save. Okay, and we are going to pause the episode there. Um, we will be back in just a little bit. So, if you are watching the recording on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Of course, the next one will be posted tomorrow, um, where we're going to continue with Chapter 3. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.